what got me interested in orthopedic surgery? That's a really good question, and I have a great answer for that. Uh, I have always liked taking things apart and putting them back together. So I've, I've, uh, I love the challenge of, of trying to fix things. Um, just a little story about myself. I, I have a, a 66 Mustang, which I've had all my life. Uh, it seems like all my life. I, I've had it since I was 15 years old. It's a 1966 Ford GT Mustang. Um, it broke down one day. Uh, what actually happened was uh, the um, uh, oil pump broke and the, and the engine uh, failed. Uh, so because of my situation, I thought, well, you know, how hard can it be to, to, uh, to take an engine apart and fix it? It can't be that hard. So I bought a Chilton's manual at Pep Boys, took the engine apart, uh, and with some help, I was able to put it back together again. It was a challenge, but it was, it was um, very normal for me to do things like this, to take things apart, put it back together again. So I've always loved working with my hands. I love uh, put, uh, tinkering, putting things together, uh, some, uh, sometimes uh, things that are kind of complex. So I've always had that innate ability. It's, uh, it's a blessing. Um, and when I was in, um, when I was um, younger, I, I mean, I've always known this is what I liked. So I've always thought to myself, when I was younger, I thought to myself, well, what can I do in life that, um, that allows me to, um, uh, uh, to optimize this, uh, you know, this talent that I have? And uh, around, the, around the time that I was in sixth grade, uh, I realized I loved science. I loved medicine. One of the reasons why I did was because I used to be a patient. Uh, I used to be a patient at Shriners Hospital uh, for children in L.A. And uh, I became well acquainted with medicine. Uh, and, uh, and because of that, I became very acquainted with science. You know, I, I was intrigued by uh, the procedures that were being done on me. Uh, I had been involved in a car accident, so my femurs were broken. There were open femur fractures. I had developed an infection on one side. Uh, the infection only affected one half of the knee. So as I grew, the other half grew, and one half did not grow. So it led to a very uh, disfiguring deformity of my leg and shortening. So what did they do? Uh, what did the orthopedic surgeons do when I was young? They had to cut my bone. They had to realign the leg. They had to put screws in, which meant that they had to uh, tap and uh, you know drill, tap, si uh, size screw. It was so intriguing to me to, to hear about the procedures they were doing on me, uh, which sounded very similar to things that I loved to do. So after many procedures uh, and uh, my own uh, personal learning, I realized that orthopedic surgery was a wonderful way to blend my own talents. I loved uh, um, figuring problems out. Uh, I loved science, including basic science. And I loved orthopedic surgery because of my own positive experience as a trauma patient who's had uh, more procedures than most people uh, that I meet even in my office. Uh, and it just felt like a natural choice. So that's why. That's why I became an orthopedic surgeon.